Hello and welcome back with us again at Klagemauer TV. During the time when massive conflicts were going on in Kiev, Ukraine, the Western mass media reported the latest news updates about the situation in Ukraine almost hourly. Nearly all the major Western newspapers and magazines made a great effort with up-to-date reportage from the country. The up-to-date reporting ended abruptly, however, on March 16, 2014, after the referendum in Crimea. Is there nothing else currently of interest to cover, or does someone strategically not want that reporting is done about the current events happening there, and simply stops reporting? At any rate, the head of the U.S. Secret Service in the Senate, Dianne Feinstein, said during an interview with CNN, the White House should finally acknowledge the referendum in Crimea. Also, U.S. Congressman Alan Grayson stated, we, the USA, should be pleased to see, we should be pleased to see, when a virtually bloodless transfer of power establishes self-determination for two million people. The basic principle here is self-determination. That is what happened in Crimea. And it is not for us, the USA, to determine otherwise. Interesting voices directly from the USA. Wouldn't it be worth broadcasting these voices as well in the news updates? Or what about the breaking news from the Ukraine? Just this weekend, 10,000s of citizens of Ukraine took to the streets demonstrating against the self-elected government installed through a violent coup, but also against the same government shutting down Russian news media. The people want to decide for themselves which news they may see and hear. It also displeases them that no candidates from eastern Ukraine were nominated for the presidency. Militant supporters of the pro-Western sector massively disturbed these demonstrations and one of their leaders said, we are at war with Russia. Demonstrations and protests against the new government took place in many major cities, for example, Dnipropetrovsk, Lugansk, Donetsk, etc. Those who organized or represent these demonstrations are afraid to go out into the streets. Why is this? During the conflicts in the Ukraine, the Western news media reported that the people were longing for European standards, and that is why they fought on Independence Square in Kiev. And now the representatives of these promised European standards are afraid to leave their homes and mix with their own people? Something is deeply wrong here. Better said, here we have yet another media lie. That is why we broadcast Klagemauer TV the uncensored news. Even if the Western media news updates stop, we will go on broadcasting from the people for the people. Another media commentary is following from our studio in Dresden. Stay tuned.